Hello everybody, I am back with another video. Um, and if you haven't noticed, I am back with the old camera in the old room. So, that's good I guess. Oh, and another great thing is I got my license today, so I'm pretty excited about that. But this is going to be a two-part video because my camera can't make a video longer than three minutes for some reason. This camera, so it's going to be a two-part video, basically one video, but I have to split it into two because of my shitty camera. Well, let's get started on that. The main topic of this video is the Tampa Bay Rays, and in this video I'm going to talk about basically how they are the best team in Major League Baseball. If you don't know, the Tampa Bay Rays have the best record in Major League Baseball, basically what I just said. Um, they have basically done it with a bunch of people who really nobody know. I mean, you might have heard of Evan Longoria, who is a rookie, who they called up this year, and he is absolutely tearing it up. You may have heard of uh, Carl Crawford, who has been basically their only all-star for the last, you know, ten years or so. But other than that, this team is basically a bunch of unknowns. And I know they do have an ace pitcher, too, but I can't think of his name. I should probably do research before I do my videos, but I can't remember what his name was. But I know they do have an ace pitcher as well. And it just really amazes me that a team that has never finished above 500 their entire existence, which, given their existence only has been, what, 15 years, but still, they have never finished above 500, and now here we are going into the All-Star break, and they are the best team in Major League Baseball. And I saw something on ESPN the other day that really solidifies the fact that they are the best team in baseball. Not only does this Tampa Bay team, Tampa Bay team have the uh, best record in Major League Baseball, but they have played the toughest schedule in Major League Baseball. I mean, I would like to find anybody out there that can come up with an argument that this team is not the best team in Major League Baseball. Not only have they had the best record, but they have played the hardest schedule. Undoubtedly, in my mind, the best team. We will see what happens as time goes on, but it looks like this team is for real. And it looks like this team is here for stay, here to stay. And, you know, maybe this could be the start of something new and the start of a new dynasty. I mean, obviously, look at the division that they're in with the Yankees and the Red Sox. It's amazing how they're doing this against two of, you know, the highest payrolls in baseball. And I just love how with their small payroll and with a bunch of unknown guys and a lot of young talent that they are establishing something there and they're establishing homegrown talent and are establishing a true franchise, which I think at this point is good for baseball. But that's what I'm talking about in the second part of this video, which will be a new video. Um, so that's basically the part one of this video. In part two, I'm going to talk about what effect this Tampa Bay team is having on baseball. So, see you later. Catch you.